What is up guys, my name is the Technical Potato and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Megasync on your Windows PC or computer. So let's get started. First of all, what you want to do is go to the link in the description below which has Megasync in front of it. Uh, just click it and it'll bring you to this page over here. And over here you'll see free download for Windows um, above or below Mega the mega logo. So you just want to click on that and I'll download. It'll be like a few minutes or seconds. I already have it downloaded so I don't need to download it again. So I've brought it up here to my desktop. As you can see mega sync setup. Um, you'll probably find it on your downloads or if you change the download folder um, wherever the download folder is you'll find it there. So you just want to click mega sync setup. Uh, press yes. And then you want to select your language. I'm gonna select English. Press OK. Press Next. Um, after reading this, if you want to read it, press I agree. Um, install just for me. If uh, you want to install it just for your user. Uh, but if you have multiple users on this computer and you want to install MegaSync for those users, you click on this option. But if it's just for your user, uh, click on this option. So I'm just gonna click on install just for me. Press next, install, should take a few seconds, <clears throat> uh, press finish, and as you can see you'll get a pop up like this, and now you can, uh, you can scroll through this and read that, uh, and then you can press login or create an account, I already have an account so I'm just going to press login, um, it won't take much time to create an account, it's pretty fast. So um, yeah, so now I'm just gonna type in my information and I'll be right back. <clears throat> okay, so once you've logged in, if you have already have an account, it may ask you to full sync or selective sync. Um, this means uh, full sync is like to sync your entire cloud. So um, if you've been using Mega for a long time, uh, you would know you can upload things to it. So that's the sync those things, the entire thing or selective sync is like the sp select specific things. So I'm just going to click selective sync. I'm going to press next. You can change this to just the location and the download folder. Press next. Press finish. Now um, you might get this pop up here saying that Megasync is running. And as you can see, you can see the M logo. So click on that. See Megasync is started. Start. Ah, can't speak. Starting. Um, and now you've installed it, installed it, and uh, you're done. So now if you want to download a folder from Mega using Megasync, and it is reasonably faster um, using Megasync and easier because you don't have to have your browser open um, and all that good stuff. So all you want to do is open up uh, your Chrome browser or whichever browser you use. So I've already opened up a download. Uh, so as you can see, um, if you go to a mega download, you get two options download with Megasync and download through your browser. So, this is to download through browser is to obviously download through your browser, download Megasync is to download with Megasync. Um, so, you, what you want to click is download with Megasync. Just wait uh, for a few seconds and press, and you get this pop up. <clears throat> and if you want, you can change the location file by clicking the computer icon there. Um, as you can see, um, I'm gonna keep it the same and um, yeah just press ok and if you don't want this pop up to come every time you can click this over here but um, I'm not gonna click it so yeah but anyway press ok um, and make sure this is the folder you want uh, the thing to be down the item or folder or file whatever to be downloaded to uh, just in case you want to download it to a, a external disk or something like that um, ok so once you've chosen that uh, just press ok as you can see, if you click on this, it will start downloading. You can scrap mechanic and scrap mechanic. Um, it's fairly fast. It shouldn't, this one is like a few MB, so it shouldn't take much time. You can see I already started downloading. And once it's done downloading, um, you can find it downloads. No, no, I mean documents. And 
and go to Mega Sync Downloads, and it'll be here. Um, these are some folders I've downloaded earlier, and uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. Just enjoy the hype. It was helpful, and uh, I'm just gonna pause this here. I hope it was helpful, and if it was helpful, you guys um, did it successfully. Uh, please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. This is the Technical Potato signing out. Bye.